ABC General Hospital spoilers reveal that Joss not long ago wanted to take down Sunny. Joss felt angry when Sunny chose Nina over Carly. There was a time when Joss wanted to support Michael and Dex in taking down Sunny. She wanted to avenge her mother when Sunny abandoned Carly. After that, Michael and Dex abandoned this plan, so Joss no longer hated Sunny too much. Now Joss even wants to have dinner with Sunny on Thanksgiving Day. Thanksgiving is a time when close people reunite. The fact that Joss wants to have dinner with Sunny proves that she really respects and loves him. Since Sunny married Nina, he thought Joss would be very angry with him, but Joss's performance this time is an improvement in the relationship since Sunny chose Nina. Joss may not be so hostile to Nina anymore. Her acceptance of Sunny means tacit acceptance of Sunny's marriage to Nina. Sunny won't have the awkwardness of having to stand between Nina and his family members. Meanwhile, Marshall has a lot of worries about Curtis trying to find out who shot him. The assassin who acted that day was very professional. He didn't leave any clues to show that the person behind him was not simple. It's unclear what his purpose is, but if Curtis insists on delving into this matter, it's really dangerous. Curtis himself's health is no longer the same as before, so Marshall hopes Curtis can take time to rest more. In addition, there is another worrying issue. Curtis is cooperating with Jordan to investigate this. Everyone knows Jordan is Curtis's ex-wife, and she currently works at the police department. Curtis will need some information there, so asking Jordan is the quickest way. However, Marshall is afraid that during this process, Jordan and Curtis may develop feelings again. So Curtis and Portia's marriage will definitely be threatened. Elsewhere, Charlotte will request to return to her French boarding school to study. Charlotte no longer enjoys life in Port Charles. She doesn't like Anna, but there's no way to stop Valentine and Anna from being together. The tricks Charlotte used on Anna were also discovered. Now, staying in Port Charles would be very awkward, so Charlotte wanted to return to France. Normally, people would comply with Charlotte's wishes, but this time Laura will refuse. She wants to stay close to her niece to care for and educate her. Charlotte's recent expressions have made Laura feel worried. Charlotte has come up with many plans to harass Anna. These are not things a little girl like Charlotte should do. Laura even suspected Charlotte had some kind of mental illness. So leaving Charlotte alone to live away from home is really not okay. Laura must stay by Charlotte's side and observe her more.